Alright, later Nosh Metal and later Bromeister. So you want my bastard daughter. See, you know, I wish the, I wish if I wish the game would like tell me if that would actually give me an alliance. Ah, but you're king of Syria. Are you currently dying? No, you're not actually. Hm. Yeah, I'll take that then actually. And alliance, please. No. Thank you. Okay. That is on average pretty neat. Modifies heretics, these things happen. Sultan Brahmad has inherited the Emirate of Taris and a Sheikdom. Does that mean I have too many Sheikdoms? Yes. Um, but we do hold the Emirate of Sukutra, which... Whoops, yeah, yeah, well, still, this guy is not really supposed to have that, so... You can just like find a random country then. Oh, by the way, uh, you my username is pronounced like Siarla. Ah, okay. I guess so. I guess I was overthinking it then, because normally when it is two eyes, it's like it's like C E R L A. You know, there's there's two eyes there, so it's C E R L A. C E R L A. Or if there's like bro i i e or like bro e i, generally I I think of two eyes in like the Roman context. So it's like um, uh fuck, semi. What's a good example of that? I guess Crusader Kings two is not the good example for that, but they they did a lot of that rubbish. Also look at these fucking natural borders of France, by the way, on the Rhine River. Any French people in chat right now right now are just not being active in chat because they're just being yeah boy I yeah so they're like the boy I not just boy although I think they just called them boy in uh, Imperator so that's the thing but these things happen Landslide. Meh. Don't really care about buildings in this random thing, but thank you for reminding me that I need to get rid of it. think that while I'm at it yeah before I do anything I'm gonna just straight up abolish this cursed duchy although then again then there is nothing actually to stop the guy who I give this to to just make it so I guess I should just give it to someone and then take it from there Equipped army of cultists, follower of Iblis, has arrived in Jeddah, led by three powerful witches. They stand ready to serve me at. What? Oh. 
I guess I am the son of the devil, so fair enough. <laughs> I guess these things are the things that happen. The plot to kill... Yeah, see, no, I don't actually care about killing whoever we're killing. That's not really something I care about. I guess I do feel like we should kill someone, though. As a Roomba says, it's a waste if you're not murdering someone. But, uh, oh well. For now, we'll just chill. And we are actually getting some decent piety, despite the fact that we have the voice of Satan in our head. So that's pretty neat. Also, did I just siege a bunch of shit for the fuck of Egypt? No, no, I got the lower holdings, but that's not necessarily what I wanted. Also, we're losing this. Which is really bad. Let's get in there. And that seems to have done the difference. That was a bit unsettling. question is what do we do with the current Egyptian situation because I'm unsure if I'm gonna get enough Ooh. there is currently an ongoing reconquest war oh neat but yeah I'm unsure if we're actually going to get to the point where we are um, going to be able to win this war and even if I win it I don't know if I'll get this guy as a vassal so let's just see what happens Oh wow, really? We just win it like that? Hmm. That's honestly pretty neat. So I'll take your shit then. Which he obviously isn't going to be cool with, so we'll have to yeet him, but these things happen. That is part of the reason why I didn't bother on yeeting my troops. So this is my firstborn. I guess I'll make him a stewardship guy, even if I do prefer diplomacy. And rebellion. These things do happen, don't they? Okay. We should lead this army, just so we don't get nuked by disease. And let's see. Let's split off a satanic army. Tell the Abbasids to join it. And start marching to Iraq itself. And then we'll try and nuke the we'll try and use the Iraqis to kill the uh, peasants. That sounds pretty clever to me. I assume you want white piece. Yeah, you do. No, no, yeah, white piece. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, fam. You don't just revolt against the goddamn god ordained ruler of Islam and expect to fucking get away with nothing. As as Muhammad before me, I have united the Islamic Peninsula under my rule. So you better brace yourself. 
Because this shit's gonna get nasty. My sister, uh, to the Caliph of what now? The Shia Caliphate. Ah, yes, the King of the. Sure, actually. We are kind of brethren, so. Although in hindsight, yeah, because actually allying him probably wouldn't. Well, no. What are you doing? Ah, oh, no, my he's about to get yeeted, so. Well, yeah, that was a waste of a good sister. But yeah, I do need to get my family married. They are getting old at this point. You can get that genius girl to try and get some geniuses into the family. You're already married to some random cunts. You're a fat, sad virgin, so that wouldn't do, would it? Ah, oh, fuck it, you'll do. You really should look for weakness in the Abbasids with that kind of money. It would be hard to take that god tier duchy of Baghdad. Yeah, but the thing is that you can't just take a duchy, can you? You can only take counties unless you have invasion CB. And am I not allied to this guy? Yeah, I'm currently allied to the Abbasids. So what I'm really looking forward to is the invasion of Egypt. Now, okay, no, Egypt is not actually in a thing against me. But yeah, my idea is to just save up enough piety for another invasion, and then we're yeeting the Egyptians. Because the thing is that when you when you have to, um, like when you invade Sunnis, you have to expect that all the other Sunnis will also join against you. And so if I decide to go full-on invasion on Egypt, I will have to spend an utter obscene amount of cash to pay for the mercenaries I need because I, I would have to then fight I might be able to cheese the Abbasids to join me if I keep the current alliance but I would have to fight the Samanids definitely although it looks like yeah this part of Pakistan or yeah modern day Pakistan has fallen to Hindus so that's excellent um, and I was allied to this guy my dad was anyways Yeah, we're still allied to Syria, so I think we're actually in a pretty good position. Then you can holy war against other Muslims. Yeah, but holy war doesn't seem worth it. Because, uh, like, a holy war, like, having to fight a war against all other Sunni Muslims to get one duchy? I don't know, man. I don't know. It's easier than you think. You got the camel retinue. See, now that's the kind of information I desire, my good friend. Uh, I was about to call you by your name, but I've already forgotten how to pronounce it. Um, Cyril. Ah, oh, fuck no! I'm pronouncing. Yeah, if it's a, if it, if it's like an English pronunciation, it would be like Cyrilia, Cyrilia, because yeah, Cyrilia, Cyrilia. I don't know. But yeah, let's go get some of that. Uh, Let's go get some of that sweet, sweet uh, fucking camel then. Or not, because I can't. But uh, it was a good idea. Yeah, because some other guy in my chat told me that the pikes and the archers are the way to go. So I've been doing that so far. So I need to stop assaulting. <laughs> oh, this shit isn't worth it. We have inherited the Sheikhdom of... Nice. The Bo Djibouti. I've inherited your booty. A good thing to inherit, if you think about it. But yeah, I definitely think a period of recovery after this would do. 
I said I was going to stop assaulting, but I can't help myself. Damn it, I just want this war to be over. There's like plague everywhere. Let me win. Thank you. None of... Oh, for fuck's sake. They're really going to make me do this, aren't they? You want to marry my kinswoman? Ah, oh, yeah, but I'm sure I made that thing by choice. So you're the lord of this land. You're pretty good darn diplomat, so I'll make you diplomats. Speaking of, I might want to think about that whole situation in general when it comes to my council. Yeah, that'll do, actually. Oh yeah, there was this whole situation. Whoops. For all... Siar... Siarla. Right. I'll try and remember that. For the duchies of Basra and Baghdad, in my, it's absolutely worth it to Holy War. Then you build trade posts in Muscat and Basra. And base the money. Hmm. But there's only two trade... Fuck, no, is there four? No. No, there's only two trade posts. Because my, my... My inclinations have always been to establish in Egypt. To try and secure... Eh, well... Yeah, I guess you can't only have Alexandria and Cairo. You can't have Demieta too, but... Yeah, I guess Baghdad really is a good duchy. And Basra. But I will admit that I have a... Uh, it's your series? <laughs> yeah. No, but the thing is, like, I, uh, people always like, oh, sorry for backseating. Like, people, like, I really do want backseating. I really do want people to tell me how to get good there. Because, like, it's no secret that I could definitely be a lot better at this. And I'm stressed and depressed. God damn. I am one sad cunt. Yeah, I could really do with a dog right now, game. Because my kid is, like, 13, so... I thought I was the son of the devil. Why is like, why is the guy being so sad? Right. Die rebel. And die Hashemites. Now I don't want to execute the Hashemites. I want to like keep them in a. Wait, hold up. Why is these? Why are the Hashemites no longer descendants of Muhammad? That's a bit spook. Hmm. Also, in hindsight, revoking this guy's shit wasn't super smart, but whatever. It just happened. This guy, on the other hand, is a cunt, so he can totally get his shit revoked. And you, since when are you fucking, uh... <laughs> Sunni? What a rubbish meme. Yeah, so I'm a Kar Karmatian or whatever, so I do actually control all of the headjazz at this point, so I could actually... Um, suffering su success? <laughs> so I do I do control the headjazz now, so I could make my capital in Mecca, but... In my religion, Mecca is not even a holy site, so... I guess we should keep it in al Hassa for now. The long-term goal is to establish new or... Like, better Mecca in Alexandria. Because I have a slight fetish for Alexandria, I'm not gonna lie. I am definitely a, Hel a Helenu, Hellenic boo. So, yeah, boy could definitely do with some of that shit, but yeah. For now, I will try and keep my unfortunate urges under control.
And so we have to go through the dance of finding suitable assholes to be granted shit. I really wish I could grant titles to my family. It's such rubbish that you can't as a... Um, No, I don't have mosque. Also, surely there has to be some content, dude. No content? Not even... Right, let's give it to you. Because we can surely just convert him. Well, I can't actually give him any land, so it'll have to be you. So you are hereby granted the guardianship of Mecca and Medina, as is tradition. You also better convert you, dirtbag. And then... You are also in prison. What? Oh, it's inclusion. Okay, okay, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. You're also. I uh, get. No, no, no. I need to give out like. I need to give it out to usual boys. Honestly, it literally doesn't really matter who I give these things to. Because I don't need to culture convert these areas. As, like, as long as I don't give them to people who are ambitious, it's generally fine. over my vassal limit, but I will deal with that, so do you not worry, game. I guess we're keeping this territory for now, and then you get to be Emir of Hijaz. Also, I don't know why this guy didn't become your dude, because he totally should be. Although I guess there's no particular reason to make him your dude for now, because I can use that as leverage later to make other guys like me more. Uh, what what you're doing for Alexander is what I do. I was able to move my capital there and convert all of Mesopotamia to cremation by the third character. Damn. Yeah, I do agree that Baghdad... I mean, is Baghdad a holy site for... Yeah, no, Baghdad isn't even a holy site for... I guess I guess the logical ho or capital for a uh, cremation uh, dynasty would be Damascus. And there might actually be some logic to that, because, uh, well... Yeah, because you could try and be Lord of Damascus, uh, Jerusalem, and Arsuf. And try and get th three trade centers under your control. That would give you good money. I mean, I guess you could just straight up make your capital Jerusalem. Which, once again, is not a holy site, but... Uh, there's no particular reason to plop your capital in a holy site as a carmation is there, so... That's the levies. That means you're the wrong religion. That's illegal. Fuck you. 
Well, I'm sure it grieves you deeply better. Uh, okay, so for reasons that aren't really clear to me, I actually have a claim on Damascus. And Outer Jordan. Hmm. I guess some of those shenanigans marriages I did actually came to pass. I'm not going to declare war on Egypt for now, though. Ah, my son-in-law, you are finding some cunt. Sure. Also, what the other guys were saying about the pike retinue is true, but the camels are really god tier in this game. I think they're the best after horse archers. Just their limited Bedouin culture. Hmm. So you're saying I should stay Bedouin, because my instinct was like converting to like Levantine or something. And again, I guess Bedouin in this game represents a lot more than it did historically. But yes, we must invade. Also, did I forget to... Yep, I totally forgot to yeet my vast... Or yeet my levies down. But yeah, I think a really quick conquest of this asshole would be nice. Even if it would trigger a war... Okay, so here's a question for you. Um... Ciarla. Ciarla. If I invade this guy, who is in a coalition with this guy, who is a tributary of this guy, will that call in this guy? Like, if I invade this guy, who is a in a coalition with this guy, who is a tributary of this guy, will that call this guy in? Like, can I invade this guy without having to worry about... Uh, can, like, can I force vassalize this asshole or conquer, conquer him? Without... Um, Oh shit, you're allied to the Albicids? Yeah, no, that's not cool. Because I'm allied to you, aren't I? Yeah, I am. Yeah, no, we're not doing that then. Never mind. I mean, I still wouldn't mind an answer to the question, but... I'm definitely not violating that alliance. The conquest of Hormuz, on the other hand. Now that I could do. I'm not really... Clue, really? Alright. Ah, oh, yes. For the first time in the history of anything, this useless ass fucking court cunt actually achieved something. Honestly, pretty neat. But yeah, I'm thinking we're gonna invade Hormuz. I am worried about that Osman thing. I mean, I, 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 then again, I guess if I'm going to be fucking about with coalitions, I should really just be violating Christianity, shouldn't I? Sicker Haya and shit like that. Yeah, in hindsight, that makes a lot more sense. <laughs> I guess it's just... A f yeah, yeah, yeah. What, what we're going to do is... Uh, ah, well, I guess, yeah, we'll hold a war with this guy. To take two provinces, even if it's a bit boring. So we'll do that. Call our boys in. Only call up our vassals, because I swear vassals in this game uh, recover their shit way faster than anyone else. So there's already a battle. Well, that's a bit fast, isn't it? Oh well. There's the uh, my brave lady. Ah. I have gotten extra health. I honestly really needed that. Thank you, girl. I didn't pay attention to. I honestly do appreciate that. Also, I'm getting pop-ups about cunts who should not have their titles. Go away. Uh, Alright. 
My second born son. Blood of Said. What do you say? Um, I almost never play with defensive packs. Oh. Uh, this is Iron Man, so I guess it has to be defensive. I forget. But I have an idea. So we're going to actually do C. R. La. Right? Ah, uh, no. No, just. Just la. Let's not try and be too fancy. The second born. The absolute chat. Of Twitch chats. Uh, and of course, if you don't want the kid to be named after you, <laughs> then do please tell me. Because I know, I, know, I know there are people who are not cool about that. Uh, or who don't like that for reasons I have learned that the hard way well not the hard way but you know I have come to learn that uh, also what I own a random as a mosque in the middle of Spain yeah, I don't really need that so go away And I guess I have no choice but to torture people. <laughs> so, marriages. Let's see. We do have daughters now. We have a two year old. Yeah, you're married to this asshole. Oh, that's actually... Yeah, yeah, we're going to keep that alliance with this guy. But my half-sister has no marriage. She's 11! By all the good traditions, she needs to be married already. Emir of Algier. Abu Barker, Emir of Damietta. Hmm. Yes, 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 yes. That sounds quite about what I would want for my half sister. That is actually an bloody. Wait. Gotta make sure I get the right one here. Yeah, this one. That is an. Unironically excellent fucking alliance. Then I will definitely gain much from the blessed skies. Rains have been plentiful and great for harvest in the area surrounding. Uh, Tajura, some of the locals cannot even remember a time where the weather has been... S See, this is why you should be ruled by the literal son, or the depressed, stressed son of Satan, you know? So we can invest 500 monies to get... Basically rubbish, but I guess I really do need piety, so I guess I'll take it. So we can imprison our rubbish half brother. Why are he is he doing rubbish? He is trying to kill some random dirt bag. Eh. I'm mostly okay with that, and it's not like I could bribe him out of it either way, so we're we good, we're good. Plentiful rains in Arabia make really makes me think, yeah, I mean, that, that's, 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 as I said, that's the power of Islamic Satan, I guess. Whatever power gave this character I'm playing right now the powers he has. Speaking of, you are not allowed, well, yeah, I'm not going to lead any forces personally as it stands. For now, I will stay in the back and try and produce children. Uh, 
A mysterious Jewish man who has excellent intrigue. Yes, yes, I can do with some Jew boys. You'll do, you'll do, but I will have to bribe you a tad. Just to make sure you don't kill me. There we go. Good Jew. Now, get those actual assassins. <laughs> also, I like how the Abbasid Caliphate is like unironically conquering these assholes for me. I got that too? Nice. It's got the wrong religion though, so we can't be having that now, can we? Yeah, what the hell? Why are these guys still a thing? That's a bit weird. No. Oh. Get rid of them. Is it because they're tribal or... Like, I did a holy war. That shouldn't technically legalize... Like, it shouldn't be a thing. Like, these guys shouldn't even... Ah, who knows? They're not a thing anymore, so we will move on. And establish good Islam in the room of this filthy heresy. Did I say good Islam? I meant best Islam. And so it has been. Right, so that's a bit more potential manpower for us. Also, I really need, do need to learn some shortcuts, so let's start working on that. We have inherited some rubbish. Um, I really wish I actually paid attention to what that was. Because I now do not know, but I, whatever I just inherited, I'm gonna yeet away Djibouti. Djibouti might be nice, but actually owning thick mosques in Alhasa is honestly better. That, however, brings us over the limit. So we own Sheikdom of that, which I honestly wouldn't mind just yeeting, but we cannot do that for reasons unknown. Do have this emirate, which is a dumb one, so we'll give that to you, I guess. We hold the Sheikdom of this place, which is decent one, so... Yeah, I guess actually we kind of have to keep that, don't we? Although... Wait, I'm only allowed to hold two sheikdoms? 